Just be changing the brakes on this uh, Craftsman ride mower today. Right there. And we're going to take that put it in neutral. Roll this around right here if you can get to that key. Pop that out. Take that washer off. Wiggle the wheel. That's the key that holds the wheel in place. First thing we're going to do is pull this pin out, take this washer off. There's your brake pad right there. And you're going to have a, another piece right here that goes up against the brake pad in between these pins. We're going to take this all apart and clean it. To adjust the brake pad up against your uh, brake disc is this right here. You just screw that in. But right now we're going to take this apart and clean it. Pretty self-explanatory. Look, man, all you got to do is just drop these out. I'm just going to go in there and take a little brush to it and brush it up real quick and bring it right back. Before I do that, I'm going to take this off. Just wiggle it. It's got a key to hold it in place. There's the key. Here's your other brake pad. Like pulling the tooth. Like pulling the tooth, baby. There we go. This is the one I flipped a while back. Okay, in the book, it's gonna show two different uh, brake pads. The ones I took off were two of them just like this. The smaller brake pad goes back here in the back. Line this up with that keyway. This on here like this. in there like that the two pins in if you're new to my channel my channel is all about saving you time and money with my how to's and product reviews hope this video saves you some time and some money all the parts that I used in this will be left in the video description down below and if for some reason you want to put back the same kind of brake pads that you took off then there's no problem with using the same size brake pad. It's just not what the uh, book calls for. The way this works is you got your pad in there, push this and it pushes your pad out. Put the spring back on. Free moving. Locked. Okay, now we're going to adjust the spring if it needs it. 
supposed to be an inch and a half in between there. You know what? I haven't had any issues with it. I'm going to leave it like it is. But the uh, jet, because see, it's not that far from there to there. You know what I'm saying? It's only like one round off, so uh, we're going to leave that where it's at. But that's what it's supposed to be is an inch and a half in between here. Okay, we're going to put the wheel back on. I'll put some grease on this shaft. You want to put your uh, pin right there, your keyway. You want to line that keyway up with one, the groove in your tire, your wheel there. Sometimes you want to hold that keyway in place while you slide your wheel back on. Put this right here. Locked it in. Oh, I forgot something. You know what I forgot? Haha, <laughs> forgot the washer. Alright. boot on the boot these things are hard to get on sometimes if you can't get them on you just take a hair dryer to it to make it a little more pliable and it'll pop right on but if you just keep working at it it's on there Hey y'all, thanks for stopping by, thanks for watching. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, like, share, subscribe. You have a good one now, and you come back. You. Wasting quality camera time. There we go. Welcome back, Van here, and my unit's bigger than yours. My unit is su surprisingly smaller. This is Salmon Farms pickled jalapeno quail eggs. What do you think that is down there, man? The seeds from the jalapenos? I don't know. Quail poop. Ooh. That's, Ooh. How, that's how my butt's going to make after eating these. <laughs> Look at that. Mm. Let me see what we got here. Let me Man, see will you send me a picture of that later on? <laughs> me on the toilet? No, what your butt's going to look like. Oh, oh you said God. it's going to sound like that, didn't you? Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Smell that. <sighs> that smells so good. Yeah. Look at the color of them. I know. They're not even white. No, they're orange color. I like it. I guess I want the orange from the carrot, I guess. Mm. Something colored it. Right. You want to do that?